MTV Next. I've only seen it like one or two times. I really have no idea the premise of the show other than what they're explaining to us right now. We'll learn together. I think I watched it with my sisters had it on when I was younger, but uh, this is all brand new to me. Let's get into it. One bus, five daters. They'll get cash for every minute they last. The one that makes it to the end will choose. Either go on a second date or take the money. Careful what you do because you may be next. Okay, starting to remember. So there will be contestants and they all go on the same date with the same girl. And then you got to pick the best one or something. I'm Candy. I'm 23. And today I'm going on an all-star date. Why are you yelling? We have you mic'd up. You don't need to scream. I'm going on an all-star date because it's nothing but the best for me, baby. All-stars, it's time to prepare for a rap battle. God, it's so 2011. I'm going to train you. I'm 23. Last time I didn't get off the bus. What the fuck is going on? I think from my limited experience watching some Chris James videos on Next, I remember he makes fun of like this stuff. What are they all doing? They hyping him up? So Candy's the one they're all going on a date with. I'm gonna train you, I'm 23. Last time I didn't get off the bus. What the fuck is that one? Is it the name? I'm Juke, I'm 24, and I'm a religious man. <laughs> Lord, don't let me get next to it again. Bro, I just want to go back and watch a different fucking square every time. Last time I didn't get off the bus. Is it the name? I'm Juke, I'm 24, and I'm a religious man. Juke? Dude, so much is happening. Juke? Uh, With like a Macron? Or whatever the hell this thing is? What the hell? Amen, my brother. And then what the hell's he even saying? God, sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm Juke, I'm 24, and I'm a religious man. Lord, don't let me get next to it again. Okay, you know why I had to go back? He said, Lord, don't let me get next to it again. I thought he said, Lord, don't let me get my again. And I was like, I gotta rewind. That's not what he said, thank God. I'm scripture, I'm 25. In scripture, your best friends with Juke? What are we talking about? Scripture with a K. I'm 25 and my motto is, it's the next me once, shame on me. It's the next me twice to kiss my white ass. That's a tough fucking saying, dude. I can barely understand it. So it's called next when you deny them, I guess. You say next, uh, thank you, next. I'm Brian, I'm 19. Oh, you can't come in with a name like Brian after a Betray you, juke, and scripture. <laughs> <laughs> Lame ass. I usually want to make fun of you, but now you're actually the on one out. You're kind of a fucking loser, Brian. I was next to because I suck at Spanish dancing. This time I'm gonna show off my French and skills. Nice. I'm Dix. I'm 19, and the only reason why I'll get next to it again is if this chick doesn't like Dix. You got a name like Dix. You gotta do a pun with Dix. If I had that name, I'd be doing that pun all the time. It's because she doesn't like Dix. The guys are all stars back for a second time. Candy wants a rapper who's in his you know what, prime. You know what's in my head from the show? What I do remember very specifically, like the only thing I remember when my sisters had this on was there was like one episode where this dude brought like a pair of girls' panties on the bus and he was like, yo, check these out. And they're all like, what? That's the only memory I got. What were some of y'all experiences that y'all been through? Uh, well, I went out there. I was the first one up. All the, way, all the way, all the way, all the way. Oh, come on. Oh, oh, next. So I was expecting Kathy Ireland, and I met uh, George Ireland. <laughs> <laughs> References don't hey, hey, yo, fellas, I'm up first, and it's about damn time. Yeah. All right, Australia, get in there. What you got? Oh, yeah. Come off the bus, fuck boy as hell, dude. Come off the bus doing this shit. Oh yeah, hold on. This is the other thing, dude, right? They have like the funny stats. Fluent in Arabic. Claimed to look like Denzel Washington. Didn't get off the bus last time. That's not very funny. Now that'd be better than that. Wow, free hugs. Can free I get hugs. one? Sure. Oh, Atreyu, no! Oh, Atreyu! I mean, at least the free hug shirt kind of set it up. But rough. You don't want to be that stereotype. How are you? I'm Candy. Nice to meet you. Well, here's the deal. I love to rap, and today we're going to test your skills. Okay, I love to rap too. Are you up for the challenge? Definitely. That's right, a coincidence. Right. If that was me, I'd be like, shit, I'm out. What do y'all like to do on, on your weekends? I just grind it out, work money in between, night shift, all, studio all day. I started off watching cartoons, eat my cereal, you know, I still got a kid in me, feed it. Maybe a club later on. <laughs> So the dudes just kind of have to like row it down and have an awkward ass conversation while they're on a date. That's great. I love that. What do you mean go to the club? Brian, you're 19. Stop trying to fit in with all the other weird name people. You're not at the club. The Mickey Mouse Club. Oh boy. <laughs> 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 
They on crack? What is what the fuck was that? Alright, we're gonna drop this sick beat and see what you do. It's all about the next show. They got him in the studio? Is this the date? We're actually just producing a song. We are desperate for some talent. Shoot five guys. One of them's got to have some bars. Yeah, good luck. It's a boy, it's Trey you getting off the bus. I see this girl. It's like a crush. Love at first sight. She wearing the blue. She looking real true. I want to get about this boo and go and get a free hug. I'm not a scrub, but I'll tell you, we can rub a dub in the bathtub. Me and you, it's all good. Her name is Candy. Candy. Uh, yeah. I say that it comes in handy. It comes in handy that her name's Candy, I guess, supposedly. He's a real, uh, he's a real Harry, not Styles. Who's a really good freestyle? Harry, Harry Mac, baby. He was like Harry Mac in there. That was real hot, but you are the first guy off the bus, so it has to be somebody better. Next. What the fuck, Candy? God damn, brutal as shit. Really let him down immediately. God, he's like, what the? I was spitting flames. What are you talking about? They called the fire department. I was killing it. You sure? I'm positive. This All Stars, baby. Sorry. This All Stars. <laughs> are they all rappers? What do you mean this is All Stars? This is like the worst group of people for rapping. Do any of them actually rap? Boy, sure could flow, but mama's gritty, so I told him where to go. Next. I want my hug back. That's the least cool thing you could have said. Juke's up next. Yeah! Who's up next, Juke? The religious one. I freestyled my ass off, but that chick was hating. Juke, you up next, man. All right, the Lord be with me. Good luck. Yeah! Yeah! The Lord giveth me bars. <laughs> the Lord bless me with them rhymes. And Juke's got a big old forehead, man. It's like a mix between Forrest Gump and <laughs> Doogie Howser. Immediately talking shit, Brian? Holy god damn. He wasn't even off the bus yet. You started talking shit about him. God, wow. Good luck, yeah! Yeah! yeah, they're hyping him up. Oh, Juke, our guy, yeah, you're the best. You're the best. Yo, dude, that guy's forehead, I could land a plane on that thing. Get him! Get him! And Juke's got a big old forehead, man. It's like a mix between Forrest Gump and I Doogie Howser. Doogie Gump. <laughs> Please don't I know I'm me. one to talk. <laughs> I hope she's got a formula like Eva Longoria. Another reference I don't get. Worked as a kid's birthday performer. Don't like that. Got kicked out of church camp for kissing a girl. Like that. Got nexted for being physically weak. Okay, that sucks. All right. mm, mm, mm. How you doing? Good, how are you doing? Mm. Better now. Well, I'm Candy. Okay, I'm Juke. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Well, the last guy, his rapping was good, but I do need something better. You think you can handle that? Rap challenge is a done deal. All right, step up to the mic. I'm gonna go back in there and see how you do. All right. Damn straight. Please yeah, make it Christian related. Coming up next, All Star Edition. Bought All Star Edition. Oh, cause ones I got next to before. <laughs> Yo, yo, please believe when I conceive my best array of talent, no doubts to bounce in my feet. You fucking doubted him? That might just actually be logic, dude. Okay, so bomb the most, I'm most both those who stay. Watch the post show host break it down this way. Evolution began, fan MTV. Late 90s was probably like this scene. I would take these videos, watch them over again. Slow motion, hoping to get my shoulders in. Line with the choreographical movements, grooving my feet to the beat. Some students said that move looks sweet. So they say, yo, you ain't from the hood. I said, I know, just chilling like a white man should. It's all good. <laughs> All right, yeah, we doubted him, dude. He had that shit prepared, dude. I'm not even sure that was freestyle. That was great, man. Bars on bars on bars. That was sick, but we don't have any chemistry. Next. We got no chemistry. He was rapping. Why would you have developed chemistry? It doesn't make any sense. What are your parameters? What did you want him to do? Ask you questions about your day mid-rap? He was spitting flames, dude. Candy, you're out of your mind. But I love you. <laughs> it's all good. No, it's not. Oh, shit. But I love you. You know what? Wait, could someone explain this? I don't really know next, but like, did he just okay. make $8? <laughs> What is this graphic for? Yeah, he was in there for eight the minutes, so we got eight dollars. This show doesn't pay yeah. to anybody. That's so little covered. money. With scripture's up next. Scripture, dude. Yeah. What up, man? What, what happened, man? man? What happened? Yo, I laid it down, but instead of junk in her trunk, that girl had junk in her ears. Scripture, you're up next, man. Uh, his bars were killing, and I thought he had something better coming up there. Oh, no shit. more mud ducks for me, hopefully. Oh, <laughs> oh no. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. 
the girl is like five nine, so scripture is like five feet. <laughs> the bars will speak though. Five feet. <laughs> Uh, get his ass. So they always talk shit when they leave. <laughs> <laughs> Scripture 25. Plays piano, shaves himself everywhere. Uh, instantly next. Okay. Next. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. Nick, I want to throw explosions. I want all the effects that we got. <laughs> Oh my God, what a tense moment. Wow, Candy, I never thought I would say this. I think Candy might be kind of a bitch. I got the whitest black chick the OC had to offer on this one. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> How does that have to do with anything? What are we talking about? <laughs> <laughs> Next. I'm gonna take the dollar from the last show, add it to this dollar, then donate to her lack of ass foundation. <laughs> Scripture didn't get a Lack chance to rhyme because <laughs> <laughs> It's been one minute. Yo, what's good, dude? Yo. Man, that was quick. <sighs> all I got to say is, wow, you were right. She had no butt at all. And she had a <laughs> for a laugh. That's Brian, what your laugh next. is. Like, what do you mean she got a <laughs> That's your laugh, bro. <laughs> I guess he was doing that to make fun of her, but I think he was also doing that too. I don't know. <laughs> All right, Brian. You guys think Brian is going to do? Brian will probably go up to her and say, hey, I'm Brian. What's your name? Would you like to reproduce? See, now that's what I thought Juke was going to do. <laughs> <laughs> Back by popular demand, it's Brian. Come on, baby. Brian, 19. Tell her at a credit union. Push an old lady off a bus. Wish there was more context on that. Got an exit for his poor matador skills. Slay. How you doing? All right, yourself? Good. I'm Candy. I'm Brian. Nice to meet you, Candy. Well, I don't have any time to waste, so I want to see how you flow on the mic. Should be a waste. <laughs> we'll, we'll see about this. Here, Brian Andy, is oozing with confidence, so this should be great. Hey, yo, Juke. What's up? What happened on the date, man? What did you tell her? I told her I loved her. You told her that in your flow that you love her? Nah, I just told her like, peace You told out. her you loved her. I didn't tell her I loved her, yes, man. Yes, you did. I did not tell her I loved her. I think I blacked out. Did he not just say, I told her I loved her, and then said, I didn't tell her I loved her? I told her I loved her. Yeah. I did not tell her I loved her. I told her I loved her. You told her you loved her? Nah, I said, fuck you. So you must have misheard me. Yeah. I did not tell her I loved her in the flow. You told her you no loved one her even the said right. love. All right, let's get started. <laughs> Oh shit, that All was right. real. Got that? Let me into this. Like double dutch. My name is Tiny Mac and I'm here to attack. The girl thinks I'm a cutie, but my rhymes is whack. The guys on the butt. Oh my god, damn it! You're there going it goes. too fast, it's man. Off. I'm just gonna have to go to shout outs. Just like, just like all these old bad rappers nowadays. Yeah, that's, that's my little homie T Money. T Money got D Ray. We got LL. Be doing producer plugs in the middle of the song? No, that goes at the beginning, Brian. You suck, next. You know, he gave it a shot, though. I wanted a boy that could drop a beat, not a boy that was dropped on his head. Then you should have gone and talked to Juke. Bring Juke back in if you wanted a guy that had the beat, because Juke had it, man. I just caught a hot track. Candy rejected Ryan with no regret, because he was the worst rapper yet. Dix is up next. Dix, baby. Oh, what's up? Oh, what's up? Oh, no, no. What she couldn't handle my fat beats. Dix, you next? Peace! <laughs> Get her. Dude, how do they find five of the same dude? They're all just down to act like the same way. I kind of love it. Dicks. Eats Chinese food every day. Can fart on cue. Got an exit when he couldn't get past a bouncer. Girl, you're fine. You're looking all blue and stuff. I want to see you in the buff. What the hell? Next. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> it's been like five months since Tim Robinson third season came out, but God, I've been saying what the hell so much. I find it funny whenever it's said, what the hell? Free hugs, need to get a big hug. Yo mama, I didn't wait all damn day to get that full taste of this candy. Shit. Lucky for her, I already ripped one on the bus. <laughs> so fucking stupid, dude. <laughs> what a pause too. <laughs> Lucky for her, I ripped one on the bus. <laughs> I keep looking at his face, dude. Oh, I'm crying. Dix came in singing a song, but Candy told him to move along. 
And since none of the four other all-stars came out strong, Candy's day has gone all wrong. Man, five out of five, she is an all-star hater. I'm just glad to be back in the bus with y'all! Oh, yeah! Damn, I should've kept the tray you. Why a tray you? Her teeth were yuck, you look like a duck. I had no luck, and Candy, you suck! Boys. All right, what do they do now? They all lost. What's the next thing? 21. There's more guys? Okay, there's 10 more minutes of new guys. All right, sure. A girl who wants to rip it up. Oh, Levi a skater. I've got five girls waiting on the bus to date me that were so choice. Oh, we do a girl and then we do a guy. I see. So now we got five girls. How cringy are they going to be together? I'm so curious. I'm Kara. I'm 22. And last time I was next to for having- You don't have to yell, Kara. We have you mic'd up. Stop yelling. I'm Kara. 22, and last time I was next to for having bad balance. So today, I'm like a cat. I'm Erin, I'm 24, okay, you're not gonna and fall. I will do anything, including voodoo in Santeria, just so I don't get nexted again. Oh, what the hell that means? I'm Laura, I'm 20, and I didn't even get off the bus last time, which is totally a crime against all models. Laura's cute. I'm Lindsay, I'm 22, and last time the guy instantly proposed. I'm looking to make this sucker two for two. Why would you want that? I'm Sarah, I'm 22, and last time I didn't even get off the bus. So this time, I'm going to show my ass, not just sit on it. Relax, relax, Sarah. Your name's on Natalie Reynolds. Chill out. One, two, three, all time. What I'm hoping for is that the girls are also equally mean when one of them leaves the bus. And they're like, her ass is small as fuck. That girl is so ugly, dude. Levi's a skateboarder looking for romance. He might fall in love in just one glance on the next bus. I like psycho. What does that mean? This is a hatchet. <laughs> Did you hatchet your pants? <laughs> I hatched up your pants. <laughs> Get her ass. Yeah. Paris first. She thinks there's no dater who's greater cause she'll be the ultimate skater. But for others hope, she just hears later and next. I'm up first, again! Woo! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they're being super nice, being super nice. Talk shit. How many minutes do you think Kara's gonna last? Try yeah. second. I don't care. Uh. <laughs> 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 same thing, same fucking thing. Yes, go girl, yes, go girl. You think she's gonna last? You think she's gonna eat shit? She's gonna fall, she's gonna hurt herself. That dumb bitch, Kara, she's got no balance. Fuck the bus, attract the skinny guys. Oh, next boyfriend, she had herpes. Maybe she just did. This makes it sound like she was making it up. She just probably had herpes. Got nexted for having no balance. Yeah, I told my ex-girlfriend she was pregnant, whatever that means, I told her. So he just carries a skateboard around everywhere? Or are they about to go skating? Hi, I'm Kara. Hi, I'm Levi. Next. <laughs> Shit! And we don't even know what the date premise is yet. Levi pulled the next. God damn. She's like, why? And he's like, herpes. You have herpes all over your mouth. I could see them. You're obviously overcompensating for some kind of physical shortcoming. That's why you're so mean. I don't really care. You probably should go ahead and leave. I am an all-star. I have talent. I want my moment in the sun. Bye. I think it's like moment in the limelight, not moment in the sun. My grandma loves Barbara Streisand. I don't. Next. Does she look like Barbara Streisand? Another reference I don't get. I only know one song called Barbara Streisand that kind of slaps. Levi couldn't believe that Kara refused to leave. Aaron's up next. Woo! Well, I think I scared him pretty good. Aaron, you're up next. Well, hopefully this guy will appreciate style. Because my tits are bigger than yours. I have to ask, it didn't work the first time. Why would it work this time? Her pants. Her pants. What are you wearing there? These are designer pants. Don't you like them? They're cool. Next. She was ahead of her time. I think she was ahead of her time. Isn't that shit in now? I think that would be so normal now. Maybe back then those pants were crazy. Party pants, activate. Well, maybe if you're really weird about calling them your party pants, but. Aaron. <laughs> it's definitely just some guy in the studio who's writing this. He's like, dude, I hated that girl. Keeps talking. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna put that down, actually. No, I'm gonna write that. Yep. No, talks incessantly. Has a crush on Weird Al Yankovic. Look at it. You got next to her ugly pants. Even the producer's like, yeah, that shit's ugly as fuck. You're back on the bus. Next. Oh. 
do the show, Levi. Levi, do the show. There's dates to go on, Levi. I don't even know what you can't next him like that. Oh my God. I thought when Candy did to the first guy, I thought it was like a rare moment where that happened right away. This is happening so fast. I swear if it's the pants, Levi, if Levi says it's your Levi's, I'm going to lose it. No, I don't want, no. Well, you can obey this. I ain't obeying <laughs> Where did she buy those clothes? Forever ugly? Oh, it really was the pants. Laura's up next. Woo! All right. Oh, back so fast. I hope you like white ass trash. <laughs> the silence on that. I hope you like white ass trash. Or like, I'm excited to meet him. You're up next. All right, ladies. Well, I hope this guy. Okay. Um, I think all women are beautiful. Just want to clarify that. I think all women are gorgeous. Laura specifically is very hot, and I think she'll be fine. <laughs> Laura, 20. Member of the Mile High Club. Dumped a guy because he couldn't hail a cab. Now, I wonder if that's like a poor thing or like maybe he actually just didn't know how to like, because that just might have been me. Didn't get off the bus last time. So we've been seeing people show up to the date and they're like, no. How do you not get off the bus though? Someone likes somebody before them. I guess that's gotta be the only way. Is the Mile High Club a weed thing or a sex thing? Sex thing. I think we found the person not in the Mile High Club. <laughs> Am I right, rest of the chat? I guess we found the person that's in like the two inches club. Two inches high club. Get it? Hi. I'm Laura. I'm Levi. Nice to meet you. Yeah. Although that would be a great idea. The Super Mile High Club or the Mile High High Club. Ooh, oh, that'd be some killer ass merch. The Mile High High Club where you have sex high on a plane. Pretty cool club. Kind of great. I don't even smoke anymore. I get panic attacks. But I really want to sell that merch. I'm kind of a skateboard junkie. I'm looking for a girl that's got some skateboarding skills. You think you can handle it? Of course. Okay, right, yeah, he didn't next right away. Okay, She's wearing heels. I'm not sure how she's gonna. Well, I'm pretty much the worst dater ever. No way. Yeah. <laughs> so my overbearing Jewish mother is probably gonna make me propose myself. <laughs> Ew. She's Jewish. Ew. <laughs> That's a joke. So my overbearing Jewish mother is probably gonna make me propose myself. <laughs> Ew. Okay. Therefore, Aaron. <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, the tramp stamp You've too. You've stolen my heart today with your pants. <laughs> she switched sides. She switched teams. One Levi denial later, she's switching sides. We both got nested means we're kindred spirits. So what do you say? Next. Damn. <laughs> All right, what we got today is an obstacle course. You got one minute. Skate. I mean, dude, like the other ones, he nexted right away. And here, they got a full ass sushi date set up. Oh my God. What were the other girls on the bus like? As far as like quality, right? He's asking her what they're like because he didn't even try to talk to the other two. You could have found out. You could have found out what they were like. You nexted them. They were rat girls. Rat girls? Rat girls? That's pretty bad. That's pretty mean. Down um, to, you know, like the skateboard thing, for instance. Right. Fair answer. Fair answer. I get that. They're like rats. That guy's gonna really regret next to me because he will never get to touch my furry chinchilla. <laughs> what? Ew. Ew. What? what? <gasps> oh. I was about to take it back. I was like, maybe they are rat girls. You had that shit the entire time? Did she keep that in the party pants? Okay, that's not a whisker. She kind of is a rat girl. <laughs> no, no, actually, yeah, going back now, maybe that girl wasn't even being mean. She's just like, yeah, they all got pet rodents. Laura, I had an awesome time with you today and you were showing some potential at skateboarding. <laughs> Laura, I had a great time with you today and you're great at skateboarding. You're also hot. I had an awesome time with you. We should do this again sometimes. Do you want to have sex, Laura? Come on, man. Act natural. You're in front of a pretty girl. Act natural. This day for 76 minutes now, which means you've earned 76 dollars. What the fuck? I wasn't even looking at the timer. I thought the dates were supposed to be eight minutes, 10 minutes max. We've been on this date for 76 minutes. Holy shit. They were really cheap as fuck on this show. For a 76 minute date, you get 76 dollars. Now here's the thing. They give either shit take the show. money or you can take the second date with me. It's up to you. $76 or a second date. I hope you like white ass trash. Not bad for a girl. The kind of girl that likes to stick around. <laughs> All right, maybe the $76. So I had a great time skateboarding and physically you're hot. I love it, but that's kind of the problem. You look a lot like my ex-boyfriend <laughs> and it sucks. You guys believe that? I feel like I've heard this excuse before. 
I feel like I don't believe it. I've heard this. Not to me. But I think when a girl says this, it's just a nice way of letting you down. Oh, I, I like you so much. Oh, you're so hot and sexy and funny and you're so cute. You look like somebody I used to date. So I, I just can't. It's a mind fuck up here. There's no way. But um, I'm going to take the money. Take the money. Mm, yeah. $76, please. <laughs> she made like, had like, a little hop to her skip with her, with her money there. She's like, here I go. What's up, bitches? I'm yeah. rich. By 2000 standards, still not really. Hi, girls. So what happened? What happened? So long, how was it? Okay, so Levi took me skateboarding and we ate sushi. After 76 minutes, he asked me on a second date, but he looks too much like my ex-boyfriend, so I took the money. Oh, oh my God. God. That's so good. So good. Laura's ex-boyfriend must have been such a jerk. But a handsome jerk. That's cringe, but it sounds like something I would say. That's exactly like a joke I would say. Wow. All right, that's, wait, wasn't there a fifth girl? Oh, because he asked her on the date, the fifth girl doesn't get to, there was two more girls. These two didn't even get to fucking go. Oh, that sucks. Well, she said last time, I'm not going to sit on my ass. I'm going to show my ass. You sat on your ass, Sarah. You sat on your ass. That is next. I need an outro joke. I need an outro joke. Um, Levi's, I wear Lucky Brand. Okay, cut, cut. 